2K has officially saved my team, guys, and if you've been enjoying the free ping diamonds, the locker codes, all the free content, all the stuff that they've been adding and you want to see more, then like the video right now, and also let me know down below in the comments what you guys think about my team and 2K24 right now, like rate it, it's 1 to 10, 10 being the best, 1 being the worst, because I got to give them props. Anytime that they make a mistake or there's something that they ruined, I'm quick to make a video, you know, I'm always like, oh, they ruined this, they ruined that, they did this and that, but now I got to give them their props, okay, because right now they've been, they've been, they've They've been doing their thing i actually just ended up completing an agenda right here and i do end up getting clyde drexler which i love the fact that 2k ended up adding players for free through the agendas and usually they just add like a couple players that are decent never a full collection like they did with tracy mcgrady which by the way we do have less than 24 hours to complete which i'm actually going to be finishing up very soon you guys can see right here i'm almost done with some of these agendas i just got to get the assist you know i got to get the three pointers and so on but i love the fact that 2k added this because it just gives you a reason to like actually play the game and like i said i'm so quick to always call them out when they make a mistake and so we have to give them props because if they see the positive feedback then they're gonna want to do it more often you know even with these agendas they're giving us a free diamond even though i wish it would have been a free pink diamond here as well but at the same time though i like just having a reason to play this game you know what i mean because i feel like a lot of people also agree with me because i've been doing these agendas you, you guys can see all of them right here and every time that i go up against somebody online like they help me i help them they help me you scratch my back i scratch scratch your back and I love that because it just brings the community you know together so they have that obviously I've been completing some agendas as well you guys can see right here you know I ended up completing the ruby one I completed the amethyst so the fact that they're giving us free players I do like that right there they even have a gauntlet so if you want to like sweat a little bit they do have that one of course with Roy Hibbert's available right now basically throughout the whole season I'm actually five of seven two more wins than I do end up getting him and so I just love the fact that 2k has a lot of different things for everybody and then even this right here guys like like, I love the fact that they have it. This is probably one of the biggest Ws that they've added so far this year is the fact that they're giving us a good player and also other rewards to go after while you're playing Unlimited. And the best part is they're actually going to do this for every single game mode. So at the moment, it is Unlimited. And so next, it could be Triple Threats. It could be Clutch Time. And I love the fact that also within these game modes, there's obviously, you know, rewards that you can go after. James Worthy, you got Deluxe Packs, you got MT, you got Diamonds. And I've actually been able to, you know get some of these players which is a surprise to me because sometimes they're super rare i still got to get on the grind for triple it offline but obviously you know i've been playing some clutch time offline i've been doing you know some salary cap up in here too salary cap has some really good players like Dirk Nowitzki, Rui, Jalen like there's actually a reason to load up this game and before this season, there really wasn't that much of an excitement to really load up the game every single day. There's even players right here in Clutch Time Online with the Kembe, Ray Allen. Like, there's actually something to do for every single person out there. It's not just the tryhards. It's not just the people that want to play offline. It's not just the people that want to play online. Like, everything is actually, like you know people can actually go after it you know what i mean and then even moment cards they're dropping moments like i'm just you know you know we would always ask for moments i i hate the fact that they are you know pay to win basically you gotta either open packs or buy them but at the same time though i do like this because some of these are definitely budget bees for example a lot of people have been loving you know this card right here he's a really good point guard six four i just like the variety as well when it comes to different players even though again moment cards definitely should be free but at the same time though they kind of like started consistently dropping moment players again when it comes to you know 2k and stuff like that and so i do like that as well just because you know in previous 2k's we wouldn't get moments we wouldn't get locker codes we wouldn't get agendas we wouldn't get free players but now we're actually getting all that and i really want to emphasize the fact that 2k really saved the game mode this season because like a lot of people, you know, were really upset with 2K, especially in the beginning of the year. But with everything that they've been adding and they're going to keep adding, like I feel like the game mode right now is in a good spot, especially with this right here, because I do feel like 2K is going to give us a really good pink diamond next up because Bailey's really good. I got to still do that one right there. But when it comes to Bailey, you guys can see my collection. You can see some of the players that I've been, you know, I'm a little, you know, I'm slacking at the moment. I don't even have a single player because I've been doing those player agendas. But obviously, when it comes to Bailey, he's really good. You know, he's 6'11", 6'11", small forward. And I know that 20 wins, obviously, is going to take you a bit of time just because... You know, it definitely is a grind in Unlimited with all the sweats out there. But he's a really good card. And the best part about this, too, is not only that they're going to keep doing it, but also that it doesn't have to be in a row. You just have to get 20 wins. That's it, 20 wins. And while you're grinding out these agendas and these players and these free things... 
you can also earn rewards for example you know you guys saw in a limited they got crazy rewards up in here so if you're like a big grinder for unlimited you're getting rewarded you know they even lower the amount of games needed for michael red you know some of these players for example even well larry bird is still twenty thousand when it comes to you know unlimited i'm pretty sure hakeem was the same thing but like in other game modes you can still you know pick and choose what you want to play and then obviously as you're doing that you're also earning different rewards and so you're not really wasting your time you know what i mean like you're actually playing this game and you're actually being rewarded with the mt you know rewards tokens even though the token market you know <laughs> the token market is the thing that i want to see next also get some love you know because they've been giving out locker codes they've been doing new ascensions they've been doing all this right with all these rewards available you know different players larry bird right here 800 wins to get him like you actually get rewarded while you're playing the game and i love seeing that and of course when it comes to locker codes they even you know they, they've been dropping new locker codes which is crazy to say now some of them obviously not every single locker code is going to be like the best locker code but i just like that we're actually getting locker codes you know what i mean they've been dropping a couple here and there you know not the best ones at the moment obviously 2k can do better when it comes to locker codes they can always do better we always definitely deserve better but at the same time though with everything that they've been dropping i like where the my team game mode is headed just because there's so many different things that we can still get for example bailey being one of those free players next they can do like a zion williams and look at this card oh my goodness and a big shout out to the people on 2k db this has to be one of the best looking you know reincarnation set oh that sounds fire and and even like the sets that 2k has been dropping they've been doing a good job too i do feel like they're gonna give us a free john morant like i just feel like a john morant is coming and i say that just because of course with the playbook that you know they kind of like reference a lot of things they do say right here that basically every week we're getting a free ping diamond so we're going to be getting more players obviously but then also bailey is still going to be available even though i will say when it comes to these agendas right here i kind of wish that they were available the whole season instead of like a week and even though people were complaining about this initially i'm hoping that now they see that this was a big fat w that way 2k wants to do it more because if they just see people complaining you know they're not going to want to do it anymore and so i do feel like we could potentially see like a john morant you know a zion porzingis still hasn't gotten his card obviously we're going to be getting you know a new set of players soon 2k actually ended up uh, postponing that for some reason they're just messing around at the moment i could also see trey young getting a card actually you know porzingis there's so many different players that now that 2k is willing to give us free player agendas you know gauntlets locker codes moment players you know see occam is now you know on the pacers they could do i kind of wish they would do something like that i think that could be like a next thing that they could do where you know what happens in the nba the following day kind of like how they used to do it you know we actually get something within the game mode like a new c Occam would have been fire maybe he could potentially be you know the new free ping diamond for the next game mode you know trey young like i said i feel like he's long overdue same with john morant they're long overdue for new cards obviously and so there's definitely a lot of potential when it comes to especially the free player agendas you know they'll basically get wins in game modes you know Kyrie Irving you know he had a diamond early on I feel like he's probably long overdue for a new card as well you know same with Mitchell Mitchell usually gets a really good free card you know around this time too and so I could definitely see him coming you know different players SGA I feel like SGA was definitely due for a moments card in my opinion but 2k didn't give him one unfortunately but they did drop you know about like 30 new moment cards which if you guys saw the pack opening i did it was crazy you know lebron and the steph curries and everything like kevin durant they'll eventually get upgrades as well and also with chinese new year coming up next month we definitely will be seeing a yao ming at some points obviously he always comes out during this time too but i just love the fact that what 2k is doing right now is bringing more people into the game mode and i'm really hoping that this is something that they continue doing not just this season but throughout the year and then into 2k25 and so on and so i just got to give props to 2k because they deserve it hopefully they keep it up we'll see what happens i'll keep you guys updated but for now though let me know what you guys think about it and if you want to see more check out my new god squad check out the pack opening and as always thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video